In the years of anxiety before the First World War, the Jewish-born composer Gustav Mahler sounded a new tone in German symphonic music. A tone of ambivalence and menace. Visions of a remote world of peace are threatened by violence. This music is rooted in 150 years of German symphonic thought. But its nervousness and sense of foreboding are characteristic of Jewish art and thought in the early 20th century. They open the way to the modernist movement and mark the beginning of the end of many things for the Western world. Mahler's music, with its debt to Richard Wagner, is both powerfully German and intensely Jewish. It is also a summation, a farewell, and an omen. It has been said that Mahler told what was coming in the language of the past, and he knew very well that he was paving the way for a new era in music. What he could not see was that the epoch that was ending was to signal also the end of a remarkable period of harmony and mutual enrichment between Germans and Jews. Nor could he know that Germany was soon to visit on European Jewry a cataclysm of violence, hatred, and unimaginable terror that would condemn his own niece, Alma Rosé, to imprisonment in a Nazi death camp and bring to an end a process of Jewish assimilation into German society which had lasted for more than a hundred years and in which music had played such a significant role. It is not by, by chance that so many of the greatest lights in music who enriched humanity immeasurably are Germans. So there is something in the German uh, nature w which, which gives us music. Which, which, and, 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 the, and, and it is a question of you have it in your nature, you cultivate it. You cultivate it, it gets deeper into your nature, etc., etc., from generation to generation. Yes, it is, it, it is very tragic that the Germans and the Jews, you see the, 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 the Hamashmidim, the exterminators and the exterminated, the, the, the persecutors and the victim, they meet on the ground of music. <laughs> 